Hey everybody, it's Mickey, and today I have a really fun and very requested video for you. Today I am sharing my Ray Dunn collection. I have been collecting Ray Dunn pieces for less than a year now, and I must admit I am totally into it. I enjoy the hunt for my wish list pieces. I just wish they were easier to find. Here on my kitchen table, I have put together a collection in a tin tiered serving piece that I found at Walmart for like $14. I have my hugs and kisses canister that I was lucky enough to find online for a reasonable price. I also have the serve platter, a butter dish, and a small planter with a bumblebee on the front. So Ray Dunn has pretty much taken over my countertops and my kitchen. Here next to my sink, I have the full canister set that I found all in one trip at Home Goods, which I know is not easy to find now. On the other side of the sink, I have one of my favorite sets, which is the teapot, the sugar, and the creamer. Most of these I was able to find at Home Goods, but I did cave and bought the sugar bowl on eBay. Here on the back of my stove, I have the Let's Eat platter along with the spoon rest. Both I found at Home Goods. Here I have the holy grail of all done pieces, the cookie canister. This was a birthday gift, so I'm not sure how they acquired it. But alongside that, I have the hugs canister that was also a gift and this cute sign I found on Amazon and I'll leave a link down below if I can find one. On the windowsill above my sink, I have the oregano, basil, and sage flower pots. Inside of those, I just have some faux plants that I found at Ikea. Big on my wish list is the tool cup for my wooden spoons on my counter, but for now I am using the best friend puppy canister which is so sweet with the paw print on it. On my island is the large flower pot with the bee on it. Bees have always been very special to me and when I saw this I really loved it. I have bees all throughout my house. For now I just have a plant sitting on the inside and I am on the hunt for a large boxwood ball to put in it. The remainder of my collection is in my china cabinet in my den. Here in front I have the blessed bowl full of mini pine cones. Inside I have the bake pan. I am still on the hunt for the cake pan which I have not come across yet. And I have more of the smaller bowls that I like to grab whenever I see them. I have the dragonfly and the ladybug small flower pots. Unfortunately the base for these broke in the car on the way home. So that's how my collection stands for right now. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today. And please follow me on Instagram at My Bashful Life. And don't forget to subscribe. I would love to have you all as part of our YouTube family. So until I see you in that next video, I hope that you love the life that you have. And I will see you again soon.